G'day YouTube, this is just a quick video to show you guys how to install a LAMP server on Linux Mint 15. Now, just to let you know, this doesn't look very much like Linux Mint 15, uh, I'm just using the XFCE desktop environment. So moving on, now you would want a Linux uh, Apache MySQL PHP server, which is what LAMP stands for in order to uh, run a client-side based dynamic uh, database content for a website for example. Now, in order to uh, actually install it, the probably the easiest and best way is in fact to go through the terminal. So open up a terminal, uh, like so, go to your applications menu. However, I will use my normal one that comes from the top here. And then type in sudo apt-get install lamp-server and then uh, the top hat arrow which is usually on the 6 on your keyboard. Hit enter, then throw in your password, and then that will start downloading. Then it will tell you it needs to get however many meg of archives, 35 meg. So click uh, yes, then hit enter, and then wait for that one to download. And essentially that's, that's really it finished. Now mine's downloading right now, it will take a long long time unfortunately for me, the connection speed I'm on. But um, otherwise when it is finished it will ask you probably one of two things. It will say, it will ask you for your uh, your username or your password, for example your your My, MySQL password is a, is a common one that it actually asks for. Um, and it will ask you for it for uh, the root as the username. So you want to change that later on because you don't want to always have root as your uh, username. It's just not secure enough. So change it to whatever later on. But just as a starting point, uh, it will ask you for your MySQL password then to a prompt to type it in again. So that's what you can expect after this. And once it is uh, all set up and done, uh, all you need to do is go to your... Uh, I'll show you that. We need to go to... Go to your file manager, wherever it may be. Start in the root directory, which is just forward slash, as you can see. And then you go to var, and then you go to www. Although it's not there right now because uh, I haven't fully installed uh, the the uh, LAMP server yet. But that's pretty much it in a nutshell, guys. Uh, I think I'm rambling on a bit, but um, that is how you actually install a uh, LAMP server. Now, I'll be throwing up videos sooner or later showing you how to configure the LAMP server, but uh, that's just the starting point for now. So cheers, guys. Hope you've enjoyed, um, and have a good day. Please leave a comment and subscribe and leave me a PM. Ciao.